today I'm making a, a little uh, apple pie, kind of a different version uh, with some uh, gala apples. So first thing we want to do is uh, take them and give them a little peel. I take the bottom, I take the top, and then I come down the sides just like that. So from there, I'm just going to slice the apple for my pie. One of the cool things about this particular pie is we start with a blind baked crust. I pre-cook my bottom crust, so I put my beans in there, a little parchment paper, and then I just pull that out, and I have a pre-cooked pie crust. For my pie, I'm making a hot buttered rum pie, and I'm literally doing exactly what we do with hot buttered rum, but not adding the hot water to it. So quickly, we're going to make our little caramel sauce, and this takes just a minute or two, but you have to be patient. You cannot stir it. As soon as we get to the golden color that you want, the darker you take it, the more bitter it's going to be. And uh, so that's where bittersweet kind of comes from, right? So I'm taking it to a medium golden brown. And now, be careful not to get any on yourself. We're gonna put our apples into our caramel. So we're just gonna let them cook for about five, six, seven minutes. I'm gonna set that aside. Once you get done with that, just pop them in the fridge, let them cool down and then we have them right here. You can see they get just a little bit soft. That's the head start that they need in the oven so that when they finish cooking, they'll be more custard-like. To that, we're going to add a little bit of nutmeg, a little bit of cinnamon, yes, salt. This is something that many people don't use in their pie, but I like the way it helps set the fruit instead of flour. This is pectin, like you would make jam out of and some brown sugar and butter. So with any hot buttered rum, you have to have butter, you have to have sugar, and of course you have to have rum. Okay, we are ready to finish our filling. Again, remember this has to be cold first. So from there, we're going into our pie shell. From here, we're just gonna put on our top crust. And I'm gonna show you what we did here. Put on the top crust. Uh, make any sort of decoration that you like. All right, let's cut into this and see what we have here. That looks pretty good, huh? So I'm gonna put on three little chunks of ice cream and we end up with a hot buttered rum caramel apple pie. Mm -hmm. 